today here is a live 888 Lionsgate Energies, Divine Healing Freely Gifted that is coming to you from my space here in Australia with all these other beautiful souls from all around the world. They are part of what we call the 144 New Earth Pioneers Group that are here holding the space with me. Thank you and welcome to whoever is here present today or when you see this, these are living divine ninth dimensional energy space that is being held here being embodied in the human physical as we take a breath let yourself hear read and feel the ninth dimensional energy space you're in right now. Let yourself take that in subconsciously. Bless you and thank you for all coming now. Those that know me and these new Ascension Pioneer Energy videos take a lot to clear the energies to be able to come on here to do so. So I thank all of us for here, for coming in as these energies amplifies, as new unity is community and we need to physically show up and embody these energies bravely. Yes, this is all about individually, yet unity is community and we need each other as well as can I say, we are one. So welcome, welcome, welcome. We're bringing in right now straight up and we're calling in all facets and parts of ourself back in energetically. You can put your arms up and do this and bring the energies in or you can do it just visually. I just find that bringing our arms up allows us humanly, physically to make the energies more palpable. And even if you can't feel or see anything, the hand actions and movements are enough to shift things. Feel the difference, feel the difference, bringing that energy in because what happens is our energy just amplifies outwards. And quite often we need to do this several times. So today is a visual straight up again. We've got brown water coming up through our feet, rising up, up, and we're starting to flush our vessels. You know, as I'm doing this healing with you, and we're visualizing the brown water coming up. We see clear water coming up behind it. I never know what is going to come through live for us. And it has taken two and a half, nearly three years of doing live videos to trust, trust, trust. Because see the water coming up? Slow it down, slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. We need to slow down to embody. So as I'm here talking with you all, that brown water will slowly, slowly rise up with clearer water underneath. That's a visual. You're here for a cleansing and cleaning of your own energy directly, purely from the divine. I'm holding space here with other masters. It's amplifying the energies for you to have a new earth ascension pioneer trailblazer energy space for you to upgrade and do this visualization you are your own healer be very careful when people ask can you send me healing can you send me this i'm grateful please please be very diligent with your personal private energy space be aware of not opening up to everyone and every anyone coming in and, 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 and gifting you and, and sending you healings, you need to be ultra, ultra careful and protective of your private divine energy space. Now that um, as this information comes through, firstly, what is needed, uh, it is the first time that I hear it often. And that's the first time I'm hearing that, that that's what's been highlighted today. So your consciousness, reading, hearing, or feeling this is enough for you to uptake this divine healing for yourself right in this moment. The old chrysalis 
is not able to come through to the new. Old grief is releasing and coming through to the eye of the needle. Without the shell of the owl, the chrysalis needs to be grown out of masters. So visualization is an old chrysalis shell coming off right now is enough to help you to release. Your consciousness is everything, everything. We are coming out of some pretty dark family energies that has been super intense. This year has been one of the biggest years of change for me personally. And that says a lot after 20 plus years working on myself that and some important spirits brought for me to say this a few times that because I've been writing and, and sharing for many, many years, and this is all a mirror and a reflection for you for cleansing and healing as I speak. For those of you that are not aware of this energy space, those of you that hold space with me are aware and you're all processing. I can see you all uptaking and processing and, and releasing within yourselves. And that amplifies this energy to those that come in and see this. People are not consciously aware. That's why I slay down and I voice and I explain what it means about showing up and embodying because all of you here are showing up and embodying talk is everywhere talking about it and coming from the mind and the logic is everywhere embodying and feeling and not emotionally bypassing is new for most it's a new to embody we've had so much trauma and it is time to embody for us to create new joy in new work and this will take time it'll take the rest of your life to keep embodying and learning Okay, so there is no rush. This slowing down to embody is massive. Can you see the shell is starting to come off a bit more now? The pitch is starting to shift and raise a little higher. You're progressing further. Surrender to the current energies. Tears and tears of older connections are dissolving energetically. You may not be consciously aware of this. Why are the tears coming? Why am I upset? Why am I crying? Because... Older connections are dissolving energetically in a way that has never happened for me personally in my whole lifetime. So when I personally share and say this, that is a benchmark to go, whoa, okay, this is big, really, really big. So stop trying to fight or shift the energy flow with your mind and your brain or distractions. Because if you surrender to what you're feeling, all of it, as yes, it's uncomfortable, this will allow the pressure to release. Feel yourself releasing, letting go, cords and threads, picturing everybody in your life, mother, father, brother, sister, son, children, friend, co-worker, visual, 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 anyone, anyone that pops in to your mind right now in your third eye area, anyone, anyone that you've been associating with, reflect, reflect, on today, last night, this morning, yesterday, this week, alone, reflect, 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 give it your attention, give it your focus to release it and clear everything out of your energy space. Can you see a new bubble? Actually, they're showing the diamond portal right now. So there's diamond portal, small diamond, bigger, 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 bigger diamond portal is what's flowing through. And that means this is a higher heart diamond upgrade again trust show up the divine is showing me live with you all what is what's needed i cannot pre-plan because i will not know till i come here with all of your energies and i am tuning in with the divine the divine is presenting to me from all of you right now what we need to focus on the most that's why we need to show up to contribute because this is going out to all of humanity through you right now by you being here I was given less than 48 hours notice about today. It came that quickly because who was meant to be here is meant to be here. And we have 33 live. There's the master's numbers. So I'm now seeing the souls that are here. Thank you for those of you for joining and contributing. Hey, Lauren, good to see you. Hey, Troy. Hi, Joni. Lelia, Valerie. Christy, mwah, can't wait to talk to you one day. Safet, Chantel. Hello, beautiful Kay. Marinella, Lindsay, and others. So thank you for joining, Masters. 
You need to do this alone. This is a sacred journey and subconsciously, whether you were aware of it or not, or were, were aware of it or not, this is ancient, ancient, old Atlantis Lemurian energies. There's a lot of energies from Atlantis times that are coming up right now. And again, because all the words have been said and written, even Cryon is calling in others to deliver energies. Cryon is, un, is not unable to, he's not bringing through the new energies and, and that has been, or the information has been since day dot when he first started, when I was brought to his attention, when he first started sharing, because all the words have been read, written and said. So again, when I show up, I bring up all my energy and it needs to be energy exchange. So I've had to take a step back this year there's a double infinity symbol coming through for healing right now. And that's why every month, 144 gatherings are held. And you can join others in a private Zoom space like this, where I will deliver more personally information. It's more upgrades. That's held every four weeks for those that are wanting more from today. There is more. And it is like this, and it's so much fun. And it's so much fun. So check in with yourself if you're subconsciously wanting to carry someone else through. And I assure you, because I'm talking to people all the time, many are, especially with children. Okay? Especially with children. It's, it's the letting go that's the hardest bit. Letting go, creating the gap and the space to allow, to see what's really there. Let the unseen be seen. And when we see the gap in space, what's really there, we will not like what we see when it's been revealed, okay? Or that's one scenario that's happened, or we will be surprised. And then when you allow the gap in the space and breathe, because it's about slowing down to catch up with yourself, and that's what we'll be covering more in the 144 gathering soon, you allow a breathing space. So today, the message is allow your vulnerability to come up and out, cry, crumble, feel vulnerable. This is where your strength lies. And this is the main message that is coming through because the time for the final separating is now occurring. The pitch has just shifted, the masculine and feminine, both ears at balance. And I will finish off with this masters. This is a beautiful reverent space. I can feel your beautiful energies processing and just uptaking. And now the clear water from that brown murky water, the clear is now coming up, flowing through you. Feel that, feel that? Clear water, flushing, clearing, cleansing for you to continue masters, to go through what you are in these lion's gut energies, but not only the lion's gut energies, this is all the time, okay? Oh, hello, Stacey. First time here. Oh, mm, bless to you. As I was saying before we came on, I had the music rock and blinded by the light, blasting away, singing my heart off before I come on live. Um, because the realness and the authenticity, and, and I show that to those in my private space. Um, because it's just that's the realness, and 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 those souls that know me know that I don't change. This is all the time living in service of freedom freedom free from domination within nobody can take that away from you okay so it's about gifting yourself so i want to finish off with this here today thank you so much this has been such a portal blessing releasing it because the violet needs to come through over and over a spirit has said bring that violet in and what i've been using more lately is asking the arcturians to bring in the violet energies to help and it's made a massive difference so it depends on what you say, how you say it, when you utilize, when you ask uh, for what comes through. So I want to finish off and say, acknowledging where you have been to progress forward is very important. Right now, we're going through a life review and the message from spirit has come, reflect on your past to move forward. Inner child grief is releasing of 
this is old and big old family energies, bigger than you that goes back specifically at the moment to do with the Atlantean times with the misuse of energy. There's a lot, it's a potpourri at the moment of energies, which I have and been able to explain slowly in bits and more in the 144 gatherings every month in Grandmaster classes every three to four months. And then the 144 New Earth Pioneers private group that these beautiful souls here a part of and if you feel to join there is ask for an exchange because it's my life my energy please message me personally Anastasia Compost and I only offer as guided again as I come in live I hear for the first time what spirit is bringing through I own it all I don't say I'm channeling anybody else I am channeling me I'm coming through from my monad, my higher self. I am a pure, direct link with the divine for you to directly link for yourself. There is no in-between person because you need to have a direct link with source yourself. Amen. Inner child grief is releasing older big family energies. <laughs> you like that, Johnny? Amen. <laughs> I did that a bit tongue in cheek. <laughs> Honor respect and be gentle on yourself as much as come up about self-harm and self-punishment from times past that is pushing through with these lion's gate energies. Please ease up and be really gentle, really gentle on your inner, inner, inner self. How you're speaking to yourself. I assure you, I speak to many of you. I know you are doing this deep, 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 deep within because we're gone not only the tip of the iceberg and below, but we've gone below and I'm back up at the tip. And so I can see all and everything from leading this way for 26 years and I'm loving it. I'm loving what I'm seeing. I'm loving being here with you. This is a lease of new life coming together in a brand new way. When we feel how big this is and take this conscious take this in consciously that it's old family energies and from all of your life up until now releasing on a higher vibration to shift on a higher dimension allows us to release the pressure intensity as we ride this out this will be different for everybody yet similar as well Due to these deeper, below the iceberg energies, much is being felt and released. That's super intense on the physical with many who have been feeling and transmitted for some time now. Please take strength from this during this time, dear soul. So I'm going to leave you all with this today and know that 144 gathering number seven, slowing down to catch up with yourself. For those who wish to embody more consciously, um, AnastasiaBlueBeyondGuide.com website is the link for there. Thank you, everybody, for coming here today. Um, keep picturing the clear water flushing up. Thank you, 144 New Earth Pioneers. I, I just love your support. Thank you, Marinella. Love to all. Thank you. Love Sovereignty, Cardi, Stacey Louise, Felicia, um, Rosa, Amy, and everybody else that's come, have a blessed day and night and onwards and upwards. And I will keep writing um, further as guided for those of you that are ready to take that next step onwards and upwards. Bless. Thank you. Have a great day and night. And I will be writing and sharing more soon. It's up to you to step forward to make the effort. When you come forward, then I can come forward. Our energy, and this is a mirror for you, if somebody is not coming forward, do not overexert that energy. You are unable to do that anymore. I am unable to because I show up 100%. And if that energy is not met, there's nothing else that's going to go forward. Let the gap be created, masters. Let the gap be created and see what happens. Interesting, isn't it? Love you. I've always got more. Bless. Thank you. Bye.